All right, so I wanted to talk real quick just about um, a wheelchair problem. <laughs> so, um, as you can see, there's, there's a little snow on the ground here, and it's actually snowing right this minute. And, uh, you know, here in Utah, snow can get quite heavy. I mean, uh, you know, the snowfall is January, and I'm surprised there's actually not more snow on the ground. But, um, yeah, the snowfall, it's, it can be crazy sometimes. Because it's a desert, it, it's also not so crazy some days. Like, sometimes, some winters, it doesn't even snow at all. Um, but yeah, it's just one of those weird things. But anyway, so when it does snow, people, you know, they'll shovel the sidewalks. And that's great and everything, but there's one problem that they tend to just kind of leave. And let me just, just show you real quick. So yeah, basically at the end of the sidewalk we have the uh, curb and there's snow in front. Of so yeah, as you can see, like I said, there's uh, snow in front of the curb there. Now, because I'm in a wheelchair, you know, these curbs are kind of important. I mean, I can jump uh, the curb, but to have like the, the little, um, little thing that helps, you know, wheelchairs go down the curb, uh, that's pretty important for, you know, people like us. I mean, you know, curbs are kind of, Kind of a big deal and so what people will do you know they'll shovel and that's great but then they'll leave a snowbank right in front of the the curb there and for people who may not know how to jump curves i can understand how frustrating that is now i can jump them i can i can do a lot of things luckily but you know it's it's still annoying and it's still you know one of those things that i think people should just learn to to shovel the curb and you know i think i think they re really just you know they figured that most people can just walk over it and that's that that may be true and that's that's fine for most people but you know i'm not most people and if you're watching if you're in a wheelchair you're not most people either so you know it's just one of those things if you're one of those people that likes to shovel for others who are you know maybe disabled or, or people in general uh, maybe just keep that in mind you know like like just shovel the curbs so that people in wheelchairs can uh, you know cross fairly easily so yeah um, one thing that I will recommend if you're in a wheelchair like me one thing you can do if if you encounter this problem is you can buy a little shovel at your local hardware store and you know put it in your backpack and then when the time comes for this you can just pull it out you know get your little hand shovel out and just shovel it real quick for yourself so that's one way you can do that um, another thing you know I guess you could put salt on it but that's gonna take a little longer so um, again that's up to you you could also talk to you know your local uh, mayor or whatever and just let them know hey you know do you guys mind shoveling the the curb and so that's another possible solution um, you know a lot of people they will also have family members if you have a family member that's you know with you and shoveling they they should know to to shovel the curb and and if they don't just you know remind them and and that's that's another way to be able to to solve the problem so you know there's there's several ways that you can solve it but it's it's definitely really really annoying sometimes so <laughs> yeah I just I wanted to point that out and you know if, if you're disabled it can be really tough if you don't know how to jump a curb you know that doesn't have that little ramp um, like I said, I can do that, so so really it's just a smaller annoyance for me, but it'd be nice to have the curbs, you know, shoveled in the winter. It, it would make things a little easier, I think. And, you know, I think a lot of people who 
aren't in wheelchairs probably just don't realize that and that's okay um, you know just next time you're out if you're shoveling remember to do that you know you never know who's in a wheelchair who might need that um, if you have family in a wheelchair you probably know that so uh, that's good too <laughs> but yeah um, anyway uh, yeah just wanted to make this quick video talk about that because it really is a, a realistic wheelchair concern so yeah anyway thanks for watching guys I will talk to you next vlog Close till I get up Time is barely on our side